case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In the 1946 case of Hennepin Paper Company v. Fort Wayne Corrugated Paper Company, the United States Court of Appeals for the Seventh Circuit ruled that a party cannot file a second lawsuit to modify a contract after losing the first lawsuit on the same matter without properly addressing all available solutions. The dispute began with a breach of contract lawsuit, where the plaintiff claimed that the defendant had failed to purchase the agreed minimum amount of corrugating material per month. After losing in the district court, the plaintiff filed a second action looking to reform the contract. However, the defendant filed a motion for summary judgment, which was granted. The court's decision was based on the principle that a party cannot seek a different solution in a subsequent lawsuit if they had the opportunity to address it in the first lawsuit, but chose not to. The plaintiff could have sought to modify the contract in the first action, but decided against it. As a result, the court upheld the district court's decision to grant the defendant's motion for summary judgment. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit LSD.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.